Hi guys, it's Sasa Crafter. Today I wanna show you how I made this window with the curtain. It's not pretty guys. You got bored with my uh, cardboard project yet? This is um I make with the cardboard. This is the Y four inches, then this one is uh high six inches. This one is 4 inches wide and the height is 7 inches. I'm not sure which one you guys like. So I make both of them. See in the bottom here. See guys. To make this look or you want to make this look. I'm not really sure guys. See that. Very pretty. I love it how it turned out. See on the back the cardboard. Okay. Let's move to um the cardboard that I cut. This one maybe a quarter, yeah, about a quarter. I cut this long piece, two pieces at um, six inches, and this one I cut at four inches. It's gonna be on the top and the bottom. And this one I cut three pieces to make the the layer on the top see dimensional there guys. And this uh cardboard I cut I I cut is one, two, three, four, five, see five line there, two pieces. And this thing I'm not really sure because it did the uh, the flap on the top of the box, that's it the link that I use. So I'm not sure how many how many inches six and a half inches this one guys. So I'm not sure which how you gonna use it. I gonna use like this one. I like this this the tall. This one is perfect. I gonna rip this one off a little bit to get the fray look. You guys come up with any cardboard idea yet guys? Okay now what I'm going to do is gonna I mark this one down first from here to here it's four inches because this one what we're going to uh tie this one here to make it look like uh we fold in that way. Make this one make sure it's not gonna break it apart. So so this one I already marked at uh four inches there. Now the long piece is here. Not sure which side you wanna do um you are not here. See that one? I left a little bit of piece because it's on the top. It's gonna be this piece up here. See that guy? See like a about a quarter. No, uh, a half half inches. Just the same size. I did this bit little between. Okay. And now we are gonna use the hot glue the bottom the lie here guys oh you know what I forgot oh man don't I hear the one that you mark it out I forgot guys Because we need to insert the uh, another piece, so we did to make a hole that one. So make sure the hot glue is dry first before you do anything. So you left the hole in there. So on this one.
I'm going to mark where it I don't want to put the hole in it. So this one is no glue in there. Did I put the glue the wrong side? Oh yes guy, because this one cannot be uh, the same side, it have to be this side. So that means I was... We hot glue the wrong side. Not the right side, but on the bottom is the wrong one. Not really sure where I mark this stuff. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, um, mark it four inches there. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one have to be this side. Okay, no hot glue between this one and this over there. Now I need to change my battery, my camera battery really low. I'll be right back guys. Okay, now I'm back. So you want to cut the strip, the small piece, like a quarter this piece. It's just uh, from the cardboard that I peel it up both sides there, right? So what you want to do, insert this piece where the spot you marked out at 4 inches there. So you want to use a hot glue. Make sure that one stay there. And now you want to pull that one. See there. Careful, don't tear the paper or that one there and use the hot glue there. And trim that one off. See, you create that, the curtain, that one. Okay, um, we do the same thing with this side. Okay, insert yeah, this piece there.
see there, you get the curtain. And these two pieces, remember I cut it 4 inches. Again, I adhere to this on the top line up here. See that one overlap, just trim it off. Mm, again, you need to speed the bottom first. More piece of paper again to adhere this together. Make sure not my window not fall apart. Do the same thing with this one. See, this is my window. You don't have to put a uh, small another piece like mine. That up to you, your window. Uh, but my, I want to put it to um, make sure that my piece, my uh, pieces, my window is stay in one piece, not for the part. To, so this one I don't I didn't cut it because because it's no predictable it is how big your window might be uh, too long too short so in case I just trim it off later I didn't measure it guys Is this one? And just trim it off there. Same thing with this one. Mm -hmm. 
for this pit on the top you have to um, measure and cut it mark and cut there So on this side I think this one a little bit big one side big, one side okay. Just need to trim it up a little bit. See the window and now ready to paint. Um, in the hole here, you don't remember that I used um. Let's see. This one I used a uh, hot glue before I used a uh, homemade gesso paint it over. I used a hot glue and this one I used just paint it with the homemade gesso. That's it. So I don't know which way is faster. You. Homemade gesso or hot glue? I'm not really sure, guys. I think it take a amount of time and I don't know, guys. Depend up to you. I, this time I'm gonna use um, hot glue to cover the hole. You know what I mean, guys? Can uh, I use a piece of the cardboard? to wipe over here 